your Pilates session. So it's a bit longer than usual, that means I'm going to work on you even harder, but our format is going to be, as always, 45 seconds on with a 15 second break in between. In some of those breaks, I'm going to tell you to hold the previous exercise that will make our workout even harder. So now for our equipment, you will need two pieces of equipment, one pair of lightweight half kg or one kg for your upper body and a bit of abs and you're also gonna need some ankle weights, mine are a QO and a how but you can also use whatever you have, you can also just quit that equipment and you still feel the burn. So I hope you're ready and let's just get straight into our workout. I want 
want everyone to have a break now. We're coming down into lying. Arms are a little bit up on the floor as well as your legs. So we're staying in a hollow position. Lift the legs up, lift the upper body up. Then you're gonna come to a bolt and lower down. If it is too hard for you, drop the weight. Your other um, way to do this is by just lifting one leg up like this. You can flip for 20 seconds now. Breathe, guys. Exhale when you're coming up. Inhale on the way down. Last one. Okay, breathe. 15 seconds to rest. And now we're coming down, hitting our lower abs. We're gonna start off with some scissor kicks. We're gonna lift our arms this time. So you're lying down into a hollow. Right here, and one leg comes over the other. If you want to work on your arms as well, grab the weights again. And if this is too hard for you, pull the arms underneath your tailbone. You can lift the legs up higher right here, or intermediate arms are underneath your tailbone and legs are down lower. Otherwise, we are here. Really put the rib cage down, tuck that tailbone in and under. Less than 10 seconds. Three, two, and one. Great work. And breathe. Have your break. Next up, we're coming into just normal leg lift. Place your um, hands in a diamond shape underneath your tailbone. Lift the legs up. Lower them slowly. And lift them back up. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. If you want to work on the upper abs as well, lift the head up. Okay, we're halfway now, so I'm gonna count you down slowly. Eight, seven, lower, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold for five, four, three, two, one. Lift the legs. Eight, seven, ignore the break. Six, hold. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, you deserve your tiny break that is left. Five seconds, and we're coming into a reverse crunch. Up, lower the legs down for flutter kicks. So a reverse crunch, slowly lower the legs. Four, three, two, and one. Four, three, two, one. If your leg hurts, drop the head down. We are right here. Four, three, two, and one. Fifteen more seconds. Really work on those four abs. Last one. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, great work. Now our legs are hovering just a bit off the floor. One knee drives in. Then we're gonna twist towards it as we're doing a bicycle. So extend those legs, knee comes in, twist, then extend. We are alternating it. If this is too tough for you, drop the legs down, knee comes in, twist, and extend with your heels on the floor. Okay, great work. 
Wow, my abs are already on fire, but we can do this. You have about five more seconds. And we're holding in a bicycle. So, hold here, lift the leg up, lower, in and out. And halfway, we're changing sides. One, two, three, and four. I want you to really twist. Try to get your elbow past your um, other knee. Okay, halfway there, changing sides. Lift, lower, in and out. You should be really feeling this in your obliques, but also in your core. Last one. Okay, great work. Give your arms a break. Wow. Okay, now we're coming really into our obliques. So, we are here. Then on the way up, coming up to a boat. Then back into lying. Up and lower. You can place your arm here, up and lower. If this is too tough for you, you're gonna lift up only one leg and help yourself with this arm. Wow, this is so hard. Great. I want you to really go slowly. That's how we're gonna hit those muscles. One more. Okay, you deserve a break. And now we're coming into a plank. It's your choice. You can go down onto your elbow or up. We're driving the knee in. Extend the leg and lower. You can also help yourself by placing the leg like this on your knee. Crunch, extend and lower. Advanced. You are here. Crunch, extend, and lower. This is hard. I know that, but we can do this. We are already coming up halfway. Crunch, extend, and back down. If you need to, you are down on your wrist. Right, um, I mean on your elbow. Right here. Five or six. Give me one more. Okay, you can drop down now. And we're coming up like this. Remember which side you're doing. Extend your leg, right leg up. I mean, extend your left leg up. Since we're working on this side. Arms come up. You're going to lower down like this and slowly come back up. This is super tough. I want you to pull with this side to get you up. But we are really working on the both sides of our abs, on our obliques. Really try to keep your body in a straight line. Don't come forward, don't come backwards. We're coming right down to the side. Give me one more rep. Up. Okay, breathe. We're coming into plank now. So we're right here. Knee comes to opposite elbow and we're gonna hold. Three, two, one. So left knee comes to right elbow, hold it. Five more seconds. Four, three, two, one. Back to a plank. Left knee comes to left elbow. Hold it. Five more seconds. Four, three, two, one. Knee comes in the middle. Hold to the end. Ten more seconds. You can do this. Five more, hold it. Two, one. Okay, great work. We're staying in a plank, coming into a single leg push 
shock. So you did all those exercises with your left leg. So now left leg is gonna come up towards the ceiling, right here. Other leg is onto your knee, dropping down slowly, lifting up. You should feel this in your triceps, also in your butt, right here. Really squeeze the butt. Exhale on the way up and inhale down. Lift the leg as high as you can, but don't arch your back. Really point the toes. You have 10 more seconds, then we're doing all those exercises on the other side. Give me one more. Okay, amazing work. I want you to lie down onto your other side, starting off with those mermaid lifts. So arm is here, extending the body and we're coming up towards a boat. Okay, coming up, whoa, lowering down. It is so much harder for me on this side. Wow, what is going on? <laughs> Lift up, lower down. We are already halfway. And this is proof that everyone is human. Of course, there may be one side that is gonna be harder for you. 10 more seconds. I want you to do one more rep. Okay, amazing. We're coming into a side plank. So, I think I'm right onto this side. We're gonna lift one leg up, then extend and lower down. Onto your head, on, onto your elbows. However you feel is great for you for today. If you need to, you're down onto your knee, right here. Otherwise, we are onto our feet. You can also be down onto your elbow. I don't care. All I care is that you're feeling the burn and you're not stopping. One more rep. Okay, lower down. We are extending, I think, our right leg to the side. Yes, I think that's how it we have to do it. If you are with your other leg, just go with the other leg that you did. So we're lowering down and lifting up. Yes, I think I haven't done this side yet. Lower down. Use those obliques to get you up. Here's how it should look like from the side. I want you to pretend that there is a wall in front of you and behind you, and we're going in a straight line. Lower and lift. One more. Okay, I am sure you will be feeling your obliques tomorrow from this. We're coming into a plank. Right knee comes towards your left ankle, um, elbow, I'm sorry. Three, two, one, lift up. Right knee towards left ankle, uh, elbow and hold. What's going on with me today? I don't know my body parts. Five more seconds, hold it. Three, two, one, back into a plank. Right knee, right elbow, hold. Again, five more seconds. They were coming to the middle. Three, two, one. Plink. Knee comes towards the middle. Hold it. To the end. Ten more seconds. Five more seconds. Hold. Three, two, one. Dropping down. Lifting the right leg up. Coming for a single leg push up. So I want you 
to use your butt to lift the leg up, but at the same time, I don't want you to arch your back. You are here. Lift the leg as high as you can without arching the back. Lower down, lift up. Point the right toes.
into our lying sideward sequence is gonna be painful, but I promise that's good for you. 15 more seconds. Come on, five more seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, you deserve a real break now. And we're coming straight onto the other side. Extending the leg, we're gonna lift it up, then to the side. Three, two, extend the leg. Lift, lower, side, and back.
seconds. Going slowly, but it still works so hard. Four, three, two, lower down. Have your break because we won't have any breaks for our cold side. So it's gonna be tough for sure. Four, three, two, one. Extend the leg backwards, pulse. Forwards, pulse. Backwards, pulse. Forwards, and pulse. Don't forget the gap under your waist. Foot is flexed. This is hard. Especially now that we're not gonna have any more breaks. Wow. Wow, my God. 
okay? Come on, we can do this. Three, two, one. Drop leg down. Hit that butt. Have your break because now we're not having any rest until we're done with this side. And then we have only two more minutes of work. Three, two, one. Leg comes backwards. Pulse. Forward. And pulse. Come on, we can do this. 40 more seconds of this. seconds. Come on, we're not stopping. If you can, shoot that arm up towards the ceiling. Three, two, one. And we're holding here. Hold it. Squeeze the butt. I want it to be hard. Ten more seconds. Wow. I can't wait for us to take those weights off. Our last exercise with them. Bring it forward and circle. Toes are down, heel is up. Come on. If you can bring the arm up. Wow, my body. Oh my god. Do burn. Three, two, one. Change in direction. Circle backwards. Toes are down, heel is up. Come on. Less than 20 seconds. Okay, we're not stopping anymore. Then we're done with the weights. Three, two, one. Okay, quickly coming up. Get rid of the weight. Coming into sitting. Leg comes forward. Then sweeping it backwards. Three, two, one. Forward and backwards. Like a dance. Point that toe. We can do this. After this exercise, we have only three more. Then you're done. Drop down onto your feet. Three, two, one. 
come up, grab your weight. We're coming down into a plie. When you squat down, arms come up to a 90 degree angle. Then all the way up, lower your arms. If you can, on the way down, lift up on the toes and up. Down, lift, lower and up. Then we're holding. Then I have a little bit of a surprise for you. Then we're done. Come on. We are almost there. Three, two, one. Hold. Hold here. If you want to drop the weight, we're still here for 15 seconds. Then I'm gonna surprise you with just a little bit of a finisher. Then you're done. Three, two, one. Drop the weight. One heel comes down while the other one lifts up. 20, 19, 18, 17, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hold it. 10, 9, then you're done. 8, 7, hold down lower. 6, 5, 4, up higher. 3, 2, 1. And that was our workout. Wow, my whole body is shimmering. I'm gonna turn the volume down now so you can hear me better. I hope you enjoyed this one as much as I did. We don't do Pilates too often, but when you do it, you know I'm going in, you know I'm gonna burn your muscles. We did a tiny bit of core today. We focused more on the lower body, but still we worked on every little muscle. So if you want to add a finisher, I recommend you to add a longer or even a five minute abs finisher. It's definitely gonna burn you to the next level. So if you enjoyed this workout, please guys, let me know by smashing the thumbs up button. Also subscribe to our channel if you haven't already and click the notification bell so you know whenever I post a new workout. Also guys, please tag me on the social media so you can see you right here to the side because I want to see how you're working out with me, how you're progressing, and I'm gonna share those amazing results with everyone so they can see how powerful and awesome you guys are.